Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am giving you a very overdue. I'm um, sitting down and filming all of my um, updates. So this one is the Beauty A to Z project pan. Um, this is in collab with the Fantastic Ladies over on Facebook. Um, if I remember, I will put that in the description. But um, <clears throat> yes, we had um, quite the journey. I didn't really, I feel like I really didn't pan much last year. Um, so yeah, this year I am going to try again, <clears throat> of course. So um, I'm not sure what projects I'm going to do right now. Um, this weekend I'm going to sit down and figure out which projects I want to do and um, you guys will see those intros hopefully sometime this month if not February. I'm not like the best project planner in getting videos out fast for you guys um, but here we go. Um, in the last like I don't, I don't know when the last time I updated this project but um, I did have one empty for December and that's exciting. So let's go ahead. I'm just going to go from A to Z and tell you guys if I've already finished that product um, or what, and then I'll tell you the empty once I get to that. So for the letter A, it is my Laneige Lip Mask in Apple Lime. Didn't even use this because I was trying to work on another like mini sample that I thought I would get done. Didn't get it done, but that is very, very close to being empty. So um, yeah. This might roll over until next year. Who knows? We'll see. So didn't use that at all last year. Um, for the letter B is my Bye Bye Foundation in Light. This is um, from It Cosmetics. This is a um, foundation that is, it says it's light, but it's very, very dark on my skin. So I mainly use this in the summertime. Um, so I did, if you can see, I do have a window right here. So I do have a window here. I was using it, um, just wasn't it, using it enough to, um, finish this up. So I'm going to pull this out again this summer and hopefully I can get it done this year. Um, and then I love, I love that foundation. So that's probably one where once it's gone, I'm probably going to buy a backup of it or a new one of it. So, yeah. Um, and last year I had tallied for seven uses on that, but I had gotten seven uses, so better than nothing. Um, for the letter C is my Power Lips in the shade Confident. It is this shade here. I can do some swatches. I don't think I currently have any makeup removing wipes. So this is, this would be a great shade for like right now. So I could have gotten some uses on this, but, um... It uh, shows on my tallies, I had six uses on this. So, yeah, we'll um, keep working on that when, when it gets to that. Um, for the letter D, I did not use this at all. It's my Dermalogica Daily Microfoliant. This is like a powder thing that you rub on. Um, probably something I'm gonna have to do in the shower. So once my thing in the showers then I might put this in because this look I think this is just a little sample of this or like a trial size so didn't use that at all for the letter E is my evolve hydrating serum I think I've used this like once or twice it shows I don't have any use at all but I think I've tried this at least once and it just is just like a regular serum works okay so yeah didn't get much use on that um for the letter F is my Max Fix Plus spray. I have on here that this was a mark that I've marked. I don't know. I don't remember when. Um, you guys can probably go back on my A to Z updates and see which which update this was. But I have used this much, so I am ba like almost half done with this. Um, so I have learned that this is not an actual like to set your makeup. This is to like prep your skin. Well, it does say prep and prime, but I was using it as like a um, setting spray. So I have since 
started using this to like spray my brush before I put like a um an eyeshadow on that I want to like be more vibrant so yes that's how I've been using that now um the next thing went was in my big purse and I wasn't using this um because I switched to a smaller one for work this is the glow on fifth um hand cream it shows my tally I've used it once so this yeah did not get used at all just like everything in this project um for the letter h I couldn't find this I'm probably, I'll probably find it in eventually sometime in a purse or my car or something. Um, this is, it says LA Colors Hottie. I think it's a, a, like a lip gloss, but I'm not positive. So yeah, if I find it, then there we go. Um, and then for the letter I is my Bath and Body Works Into the Night Fragrance Mist. Barely use this thing. I, it says I use it four times. Like the line is still all the way up here. Yeah. This is more of like date night type kind of scent. I feel like nothing, this is not something that I can wear every day to work. So um, that's why that didn't get much uses. Um, the next thing I actually lost as well. Um, it's the Galactic Jello Gloss Balm for the letter J. And that is just like a, a lip balm, but in like a jello, jelly type consistency. Um, for the letter K, I had used up in June. That was my Kiss Fragrance, or Kiss Sweet Fantasy um, body spray. For the letter L is my ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in Lightning Bug. This is what that looks like. I can give you guys a swatch. And I use this three times. Right there it is. So cute. But I only use it three times. This is probably something I can do like a one and done shade. But yeah. There you this. <clears throat> um, the next thing is for the letter M. I did not get any uses on this because I was working on like a sample primer. And it took me longer than I thought. Um, and it's the Master... Prime primer from Maybelline. So that will go back in the drawer. Or I might start using it. Who knows? I don't know. Since that one, that same pool has gone. Um, for the letter N is my Ness Nail <laughs> it's Nails Ink <laughs> London. Um nail polish in Montpelier Walk. If you can tell, I have this much use in there. Um, so, yeah. I think I was mainly putting this on my um, fingers. I wasn't putting on my toes. So, uh, that shows I have three uses. Uh, for the letter O was my way leave-in conditioner. I finally got that done in November. Um, for the letter P is my Pixie um, Blush in Beach Rose. Did not use this at all. Looks exactly the same. Um, for the letter Q is my CoverGirl um, palette in Ascetizen. Can't pronounce things, guys. And it was the Queen to Be shade that I rolled in. And um, I had two uses on it. So it was this one right here. Probably a nice, like... lid shade yep look at that so cute but i only got two uses on that okay the next one is my avon quad um in romantic mobs this is one that i i think i had this as one of my pan that palettes one year i have a lot of uses on this so i have 16 uses on here and um i can't really like tip it because if you can tell there's like little crumbles right there I just opened it and all the crumbles were like in here so I had to move them so this I really I can this is going to stay in my everyday makeup drawer so that I can use this because I would love to get 
one shadow done this year and this will be perfect because I barely have anything in there to use so this was one of my main main things that I worked on this year and I'm glad that um, some of those shadows are actually almost gone in there um doo -doo -doo. for the letter s was a clinique chubby stick in super strawberry um it says i finished that in november there was barely anything left i could it, i was like scraping um to get it to go on my lips so i just go ahead went ahead and tossed that one um for the letter t is my nyx butter gloss in tiramisu um, I had to pull this out of my actual inventory because um, I put it up. So I don't remember if you can actually see like inside the container or not. But that right here is what that looks like. Yeah. And it doesn't show any uses on there. So I don't know if I've actually, if I used it at all if I used it at all this year. All right, for the letter U is my Tristique Highlight in Ultraviolet. That's one of these like little sample guy things. Um, and it shows I have two uses. Looks like this. Nice and bright. Maybe if I like. Yeah. So cute. Ooh. All right, for the letter V, I had my Mud Masky After Mask Vitamin Serum. Um, I haven't been doing, it's been like months and months since I've done a mask, so this probably have, has not got any use on it. It shows I only have one tally on here, so I probably only used it one time. Who knows? Um, for the letter W, this I got done really early in the year, um, was my Bath and Body Works Watermelon Lemonade Pocket Back. I use pocket backs every day at work, so I'm not surprised with that. That said, I got that done in February, so yay. Um, and for the letter X is from my Hip Dot, um, palette, and it was the Hex Shade which is this right here. I probably only um, swatch this because it says I only have one or zero uses on it, but that is so pretty. Why did I not use that? Don't know, don't know, don't know. Um, for the letter Y, which I didn't even realize this was in this project. Um, why was my Bath and Body Works Ylang Ylang? I think that's how you say it. Body lotion. It's in one of these like nice glass bottles, but I am like right here at the top. Yep, didn't get much of that done. And then for the letter Z, um, was from my Naked Cherries palette in the shade. In the shade was Feels. Um, shows that I have seven uses on here. And it is the shade right here. If you can tell down here, it sh uh, I have, this is where I mainly focus my brush is this right here. So you can tell that one, I've already hit pan in that one. But yeah, used that a couple times, handful of times last year. Um, and I can tell that it is worn down. And I can give you guys a little swatch of this one. That is what that looks like. This is like a a, um, a crease shade for me. So yep, there is the nail. And that is gonna do it. Now that it's 14 minutes. Um, I didn't get much done from this project. So I got four out of the 26 done. So that is very Ugh, underwhelming um but yeah I may or may not do this project I'm not really sure maybe we'll try it again um but let me know if you like this video if you did 
give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye!